Hey guys, welcome to the AI Photoshop Beta. So let's see how Photoshop Beta is going to help all the interior designers and architects to create their interior and exteriors. So AI Photoshop Beta can help interior designers quickly visualize the design ideas by seamlessly blending virtual objects or furniture into real world spaces. This allows designers to present realistic representations of their concept to client, help them understand how final design will look and feel. Photoshop Beta can also assist interior designers in experimenting with different materials, textures and color schemes without the need for physical samples. It enables designers to digitally rearrange furniture, fixtures and room layouts to optimize the space utilization. For interior examples, let's look into how we can create an entire interior space with the help of generative fill. So now, let's open a room render with zero interiors added and we'll start with this one. Firstly, we will elevate the space by adding a luxury sofa. So let's add a sofa here, clicking on generative fill and adding luxury sofa over there so it gets generated. As wall looks empty, let's try adding a wooden open shelf as, as the wood looks harsh, let's change it to normal open shelf with books. Add rustic wooden fall ceiling. So entering a rustic wooden, yeah, here we go. Now, just for the decoration, let me create a hanging launch and create a copy of it. So, creating a hanging launch over here, we can just type as hanging launch. Now, we can change some different style and then we are going to copy it copy it to make it more realistic let's try adding a human figure sitting on a bean bag and reading a book so let's add a sitting human on the bean bag got it now next Let's create a wall mounted TV using a polygon lasso tool because it will help to choose along the perspectives. Simply adding a TV cabinet too. Let's add carpet with coffee table. Good. And now with planters over there with a photo frame and then adding a window added and now we can just change any window adding a sitting over here then curtains over there and added a raining effect over there let's add a wall clock and then just transform the size of a clock to proportion Adding a plant sand over here, selecting type as a plant sand, generating it, change it to any style you would like to go with, change any kind of style you can select, then as the coffee table looks empty adding a small plant over here. Let's generate, change the style. Let's create a storage space on the beam running along, creating a wood shelf over here, generating it. And it's done. 
generated a storage over here and then let's create a retro lamp near the sofa generating a lamp select any style you would like to go with also erasing the overlapping part of the lamp using subtract from the mask tool let's add a dome light from ceiling generating it change the style you would like to go with placing it at the midpoint yes this was another option created by using ai tool so this is how you can quickly render a realistic using ai tool we can see the results of interior now let's see some tricks in creating our exterior rendering so this is how my exterior looks selecting lasso tool creating a shape over there as you can see i just need a car over there so i'm just going to create a shape it generative fill enter there as a car so once i enter the car is generated now i'm just going to create a swing so drawing a shape gen in generative fill enter as swing and then generate so you can see we got a swing over there well so next so as we can see a porch over here so i just want to create a small garden over there so i will just draw a line and then i'm going to generate a garden over there and yeah it's done not only garden we can also generate animal people over here so i'm just going to generate animal so you can just see here as i'm generating animal and then i'm going to generate a human being over here so you can change animal if you want dog you can go with dog you can go with different pets you can also generate human being generated human being over here and then you can generate a table in your garden right so in this way you can generate many options guys then you can see i'm also generating a scooter here so the scooter is getting generated and then yes we got the scooter you can change style again here Let's look into another interesting feature where we can directly generate interiors and exteriors as per our imagination. This feature is also known as text to image where we required to give some prompts. Let's try a few. We have got quite a few options for images, graphics also art. 
Let's start with interior design of a luxury bedroom with natural color scheme and see what we can get. Check out these many options we can find here. Can choose any one we like. And then we can also enter interior design bathroom in Portuguese green tiles. So you can select any of these colors like any of these patterns. If not green you can change with blue tiles. Right, so you can select any blue color uh, interior over here, blue color tile over here. So not only bathroom you can even go with a bedroom over here so interior design of a bedroom french style i'm going to enter granite and polish natural stone so you can see over here you're getting a image you're getting images related to the same search what we have done right so in this way you can get many photos like depends on what kind of scheme you would like to go with you can add palette knife and then I'm going to select graphic over here and then you are not we'll select photo interior design of a luxury here we are going to enter interior design of a luxury room With contemporary black and gold right so this is how you are going to create your interiors and exteriors guys right so yeah, I have also changed a style an eco-friendly hotel I have done you can see the exteriors what you're getting out of this a house modern style of style at a cliff black metal and concrete so it is generating you can see the results here yeah and that's how we create amazing interiors and exteriors in photoshop ai to get more interesting ai tools we'll get back to you guys so until then please follow and subscribe. Thank you.